the function f is defined by f of x equals this quantity here in the xy plane the graph of y equals g of x so a different function is the result of translating the graph of y equals f of x up four units what is the value of g of zero so we have this graph or equation f of x and we have another equation g of x that is the graph of f of x but translated up four units so say f of x was some kind of line that looked like this in the xy plane then g of x would just be the line translated up four units so every point on f of x would just be translated up so g of x the translated graph would just be equal to f of x plus 4 since everything is being translated up by 4 units all the y values the g of x values would be 4 units more so we can apply that same logic to this f of x so f of x is equal to x minus 6 x minus 2 times x plus 6 so then g of x is just equal to f of x plus 4. So g of x is just x minus 6 times x minus 2 times x plus 6 plus 4. Okay, so now we can find the value of g of 0 now that we have the equation for g of x. So g of 0 is just the value of g of x when x is equal to 0. So 0 minus 6 is just negative 6. 0 minus 2 is just negative 2. And then 0 plus 6 is just 6. And then we still have the plus 4. So then negative 6 times 6 is equal to negative 36. And negative 36 times negative 2 is equal to a positive 72. And then 72 plus 4 is equal to... 76. So the value of g of 0 is 76.